Yeah, I was reading about a guy who uh, worked here at Sirius. I didn't know him, but uh, it seems like kind of sad. Mario, uh, his name was Mario. Mario Comasanis. He was one of the hosts at Sirius XM's Liquid Metal uh, channel. He was working here for 10 years, 30-year-old guy. Yeah. Uh, his um, had a fiance, family, friends, and stuff, and um, evidently for those in the liquid metal fan area, they really liked this guy Mario. And Mario was a dedicated guy to metal music. He died from an aggressive form of leukemia at 30 years old. Yeah, apparently he just found out he had it. Yeah, it I wasn't didn't... even he wasn't fighting it that long. He didn't even know he had it for a, a long while, and. Once he found out, he was gone. I don't believe I've ever met the guy, but it's possible I did. Yeah, I don't know. I tried to take a good look at the picture. I don't know if I ever saw him or ran into him. Looks kind of like Booker a little bit. That type. Hmm. You know. Needs a shave. <laughs> Dark-haired guy, young, look a good-looking kid. Uh, he uh, started his radio career at uh, Seton Hall. He was at the Pirate Radio Station and then joined uh, Sirius right, right in 2002. So maybe I did meet him when that, and that uh, when, I, when, they, when they walked me through the halls like I was Jesus Christ coming to save this place. Yeah. You know. And that initial sweep. The initial sweep. Probably did meet him. Gary, do you know if I've met him? Gary keeps track of who I meet. I actually don't. I don't mm. remember meeting him. Either. Gary no, didn't no. meet him? You know, there's a lot of people who work here at Sirius we don't meet because they, they a lot of people voice track and do stuff like that. And, and also, know. we're stuck back here in our own little cave. Yeah, thank God.